All right, okay. So, we're back. No lines. Anybody who's like severely underperforming. I mean, Dominic Kubelik is obviously not doing. He's not playing up to expectations. I guess. Very cockpit near me, but he has, he's been out for a while. But Dylan Dubé, Dubé had an explosive start, but now he's been kind of bad. He's not super good overall wise, so I'm not going to get all... Jake Dawson, who's injured? Oh yeah, um, Atkinson's out too. Okay, if we can get, well let's see, can we get anything for Kubelik? Like will anybody give us anything major for... If I can't get much of anything for Kubel Kubel yes he for sixth and Simon Grant fifth and Kahol I'm gonna make it less about my guy and then let's see if I don't know if it actually oh shoot wild Oh, he's old though, so that's the same. Still says Talbot's on the team. We're gonna try to get off that. For a second, third, and Poland. Or Schaefer, second, and third. Henry, Lincoln, a second, and a third. Second, third, and Poland. Oh. We don't need goalie right now, actually. I'm not going to get all worried about that. Let's play a division rival on this game. He's got clearly better assists. We need a good finisher who can score. Ooh, a nine nothing loss. Ooh, Samsonov. He's got um, 14 wins in 31 games. I guarantee um, Simpson has done better. Yep. He's got less saves, but probably has like less games played too.
Okay, trading. They'll give us cow turf. I want cow turf. Same sona. I like Samsonov, he's a great player. Dyson Mayo, fix that on your own. Not my business. Oh, go to crap. Best lines, I don't care. Alright. Who's eligible now? We can never have a full, um... Why can't we have all of our players just be like, oh. oh my gosh, bro. Lias Anderson. Okay, you a medium, top six. Okay, he's kind of cheap. We'll take him, honestly. We're gonna go to the trade deadline. Oh, hold up, hold on, no mind, no mind. Oh, crap. You know what, we will... We'll play this game, we'll... Do trade deadline and then play the game. Hopefully he goes down to the minor leagues. I don't want him on the... We're gonna be a... Conservative buyer. I think this could be our year that we do good. Top board prospect first on draft pick. They want a first round draft pick for any of these players. Top goalie prospect. I love to know they want a first round pick. 
Oh, why is Sansona off up on the block? No, thank you. We'll, we'll see, what do they want? I might be able to get him. Second, second, and... Luos, Stone, and... Schaefer, second, third. Kraftstab in a second. Uh, no. Seconds. Yeah, they're really insistent in two seconds. I don't know if I can do that, Chief. They're old. No. And no. We can get to house somehow. First, I follow and pause the cell. No. This is stupid. I'm not gonna. Yeah, let's try the dead line to come out. We're gonna do one more thing. See if somebody's gonna offer us something amazing. But unless we got like something crazy, I'm gonna, I'm gonna need like a first and then something with that first. I'm just, yeah, I'm not okay with that. Okay. We're gonna play on weekend. We're gonna log into, or not log into, we're gonna play this Coyote game. What, do they have like 17 different jerseys? Because I got home, away, alternate, home, away, alternate, and then we get the old jerseys. Like, what? What is fucking it though?
some character controls by Thug. So, close support. Power play. <clears throat> Pop carrier, or distributor, I don't know who that distributor should be. Oh my gosh, we have, we have our intro, the heck, this is crazy bro, let's go. Okay, oh she loses. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The game is still scoreless. Houston's got a hold of the puck. Oh, he digs in and wins the draw there. Now they can get out of the zone. Oh, and a good textbook hit there. Passed up ahead. Moves it over to Gunther. Oh, that just sounded painful. Well, that's the end of his shift. Man, James, he took a huge hit. Slowly getting himself to the bench where he can get tended to by the trainer. Looking to set up offensively. And that banks off a stick. Turns him away. Oh. Poked away in the neutral zone by Klingberg. Here's a short pass to Schmaltz. Good hit on the play. Players tell us all the time that they don't know where the next milestone is. That's garbage. They know when they're one goal away from a plateau. I think he's looking for it here. Takes the feet at the back end. Some nice footwork here across the line. What a record from John Klingberg. It's, uh, I was trying to work at the John Klingberg, but I wasn't sure. But then they had one guy out of the zone. Schmoltz almost got to us too, but we're just able to actually rip that one. Camp on the Ah. Oh. Oh. And cross to Milano. Oh. Away at center by Dobson. On the attack along the boards. And he'll likely feel that one in the morning. 
Texier's got it across the line. And he takes a shot. We'll get a face off after the puck stays covered up. Don't forget, Steam Store, always accessible online 24 7. Uh, you can also check out the Team Store in the arena as well, open seven days a week. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Heat have gained possession off the wall. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Ladd. Here's a centering pass. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Receives the pass. Denine's got it into offensive territory. Hard hit with a play. He scores! What an effort to get this game back to level. You've got to continue to work even when you trail in the game. They did that. And now they have a brand new game to play. Looks like lineups are set. They're ready to get things back underway. Quick feed to White. Houston's got him along the wall. Wicked pass! Can't get it to go. And the puck's not loose. From one end of the blue line to the other. Taken along the wall by Dubé. And that carries off a body in the lane. Taken by Ladd. Blazing in on the breakaway. Oh, great defensive play to break up the breakaway. Well, he thinks he's got room to get all the way to the net, but that's a terrific defensive play to come back and poke the puck away. Handles it along the blue line. Houston's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Whoa. Puts a ahead goal. Control the game now. You finally got the lead. You've worked so hard to get in front. Don't give it up now. I think the goaltender's got to do a better job. There's only one player in front of him. He's got to look around and find the where the puck is. He never picks it up until it's past him. Houston's got a one-goal lead here in the first. What's the message on the bench, Ray? The message is to be aggressive, to get another one, to try and stretch a lead that you've just built. The Coyotes get a hold of the puck off the draw. Poked away in the neutral zone by Kotkaniemi. The Heat have it on the attack. Stops that one. Quick pass to Fisher. Here they come on the attack. Sends it across. Turned aside with the glove by Bennington. Kanisov's lugging the puck. Moves it to Schmaltz. Pass broken up. Up to the challenge as he gets his pad on it. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Gerard's point streak has been a thing to behold. You start to get superstitious on a run. You do everything the same. You wear the same suit all the time. The Coyotes take possession off the faceoff. Houston's got a hold of it along the wall. Unloads a shot! That'll do it for the opening frame. We've got lots more still in store, so don't even think about going anywhere for Rail Front. Period number two set to go here. Officials moments away from dropping the puck. Here we go. Middle frame now underway as the puck drops. Ray Ferraro sees the game like very few people do. Ray, what did you make of that first 20 minutes? The Coyotes are going to have to find a possession game that looks a lot different than that first period. They chased it around, and as a result, they're chasing the game. Handles the puck. Pacioretty's across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. Oh, just a great heads-up play by Gustafson. A little back and forth. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Puck grab by Klingberg. Houston's on the attack. Grabbed along the board by Ayapalo. Shuts him down. Delayed penalty coming up here. Looks like slashing is the call. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. Now the bench isn't very happy with that penalty. Now they know the penalty killers are going to have to get the job done to protect the lead. Houston's got it in the defensive zone. Gets it out of his own end. 
Poked away at center by Texier. Houston's got the puck along the wall. Here's the pass down low. The Coyotes have it now. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Kent. Quick pass to Kessel. From the right side, moves it up ahead. And he comes up with it. Puck scooped up by Kadisov. Slides the pass over to Chernak. The Coyotes move to the offensive zone. Arizona's regained possession of the puck. Moves it quickly over to Tessier. Tosses it to Kraus. And he takes the feed. And he gets a chunk of that to keep it out. Puck picked up by Chernak. Sends the pass over. Oh, he got paddled by Bennington. Back to back to back saves. Tremendous pressure here in the offensive end. Takes the puck behind the net. Oh, what a save on the play. Feeds it to Kessel. Here's the collision. Oh, what a stop right there. Keep it a minute. Trying to clear in their own end. And they're able to get it out and finally get a breather. Great feed from the left side. Here's a short pass to Gustafson. Scores! And the power play goal puts us back to a tie game. All that work to try and get even, but you need the power play to help you out once in a while. They were sharp, efficient, and now this game is tied with that power play marker. And now it's grabbed by Gerard. Sent into the offensive zone. Scoops up the puck now. And a good solid hit on that play. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. Houston's got the puck against the boards. Handles the pass. Sends a pass over. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Beagle. The Coyotes carried along the wall. No one home on that play. Kapanen's crossed the line and is on the attack now. The Coyotes scoop it up along the boards. Taken by Beagle. Poked away in the neutral zone by Kapanen. Now a quick pass to Ladd. Houston's gained possession along the boards. A chance in front. Picked off in front. Houston's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Quick feed to Kotkaniemi. And a strong physical collision on the play there. There's a solid collision. Moves it around along the half wall. A little bumping around, but still maintains possession. Blocker save and a good one by Bennington. From the place 99 made famous. Houston's got the puck along the wall. Moves it to Ayafalo. Here's a shot. Grabs it with the glove. Don't miss out on any of our remaining games. We do have great seats available. More than half the period has expired. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Blocked in traffic. Puck grabbed by Pacioretty. Tees it up from the back end. And a quick save on that one. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Obstruction penalty coming up. Looks like a hook here. Oh, what a save in front. Here comes the call. Pacioretty's going off for hooking. They use this 1-3-1 set pretty effectively. I think the key is the player in the middle of the ice. They've got to be able to think. They've got to be able to get the puck to the open player. And when they do, that's where the chances happen. Passes the puck over to White. Quick pass to Keller. Houston's got the puck shorthanded. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. And now he moves it quickly to Gustafson. The Coyotes are in transition. Moves it quickly over to White. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Back to the blue line. Denies him on the one-timer. 
Schmaltz moves the puck. Slides it over to Myers. Arizona's got the puck against the half wall. And it's a quick pass to Hayden. And he takes the dish. Here's a short pass to Keller. Oh, and he completely lost the shot. And that's broken up. Oh, cannot convert on that play. Yeah, but James, I mean, I mean, not to, you know, to make light of it, but you don't get many chances like this. You're, this one's going to hurt because you're right in a position to score and you don't even test the goalie. He might have a step here. He's in. Stones him on the breakaway. Scores! And they capitalize with the power play. And here they've taken the lead. I love watching this team when they get on the power play when they're confident because that puck starts getting zipped around. They can attack low. They can use a point shot. Really hard for the penalty killers to catch up, and they just couldn't this time. Aya follows. Got the puck. Arizona's got it in their own zone. And he slides it quickly to Erickson. Now he takes it over the line. There's a firm collision. And he slides it quickly to Pacioretty. Makes a move, and the puck hops away from him. The Coyotes will play it from the defensive zone. Puck scooped up by Ayafalo. Oh, that's got the crowd bussing after that stop. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Surprise, surprise, surprise. This fan base, uh, not exactly a fan of the call, right? No, you can hear their frustration. They've had it with the official. And the players are losing it, too. The Coyotes once again send out their power play unit. They've already been successful on the power play. No need to change anything. But you can't lose the urgency that made it work earlier in the game. And that's a solid clearing attempt on the play. Keller's dangerous, and he's got the puck now. He had the go-ahead goal earlier on. Quick feed to Klingberg. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Arizona's got a hold of it against the wall. Poked away at center by Dobson. The pass out front! And he denies that great opportunity there. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Texier. Back to the point it goes. Stars! And just like that from out of nowhere, we're tied! Man, did their bench explode, James. Here you are, just hoping your penalty killers can hang on, keep the game close, and they come up with a huge play to even the score. Oh, that's a great effort, shorthanded. They're just trying to keep the game close, make sure their team doesn't fall back by two, but that effort allows them to tie the game shorthanded. That's great work. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Dumps the puck in. Arizona's got the puck along the boards. Here they come up along the wing. Houston's penalty killers get a hold of it. The Coyotes will get some fresh legs out there as they continue this power play. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Gains the zone along the right wall. And he makes the save. Beatington's gonna bounce on it, and he'll take the whistle. He's usually a pretty conservative goaltender anyway, and so the opportunity to kill the play, he's gonna take it. Hayton's looking to win this draw and this man advantage here. Houston's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Takes the feed from the wing. Two on one. Scooped up along the wall by Kent. The Coyotes get a hold of the puck in their own end. Houston's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. Second period nearly in the books here. Gives them nothing in front. I have follows ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Houston's got it in the offensive zone. Oh, what a block! He'll get up, trying to shake the defender. Broken up. Hayton's got it along the wing. Here's 
the chance. Oh, that's right off the mask. The Coyotes certainly didn't get the result they wanted on that power play, giving up a shorthanded marker. Well, they're not going to think too much about that. You, will, you want to at least generate a little momentum on your power play. Not only did they not score, they gave up a shorty, which is always deflating. And there's the horn. Two down, one more to go. Both teams will get a chance to uh, catch their breath and get ready for a big third period next. Players are set. Officials are set. Third period action is coming up. We are underway here in the third, and this could come down to next goal wins. Stopped by the goaltender. That's a really good save. I think the goalie's probably surprised he was dead center and open to shoot that puck. Turn that chance aside. But he came out and challenged him. Good save. Moves it to Iafalo. Moves the puck along the half wall. From one point man to another. And a strong effort on that play. Takes the feed. Houston's got a hold of it along the wall. And now it's over to Kessel. Houston's looking to break out of their own end. Pacioretty's picking up steam. Now a quick pass to Gerard. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Moves the puck over to Gerard. And now he tries to get it across to Kotkaniemi. Can't make it work. The Coyotes have it against the wall. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Sends it in on the attack. Dobson stick handling in his own zone. Keeps hold of the puck. With possession along the wall. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. From behind the net now, he scoops up the puck. Dobson's taking it from his own end. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Good cut, Kane. Good to Vander Kane. Drops it down. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Hoping here before he doesn't get that. Pass off to help he gets it off. Big body check. Oh, he Passes it over to Dobson. Okay, he won't want to keep going. Cut on to the outside. The ripper. Get that. Thank gosh we're back there. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Center and feed. And that's stopped. Slides the puck over. And a smart hits up play to poke that away by Milano. <laughs> Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Uh -huh. We got a tie game. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Tees it up from the blue line. Slides it up to Kraus. And now he moves it quickly to Kapovienko. Houston's gained possession along the boards. Nice feed. Along the half wall with the puck. And he takes the feed. Here he is. Takes the shot. We got him your goal, buddy. Logan Stanley. It wasn't even a good shot though. Like he didn't pull out my move. It wasn't a bad shot. I didn't mean like it's a bad shot, but it was, he didn't like put all of his might into that or anything. They're in a good position here now that they have the lead. They can control how they want to run their lines onto the ice and try and bring this home. And that's knocked away by White. Slides the puck to Beagle. Houston's got a hold of it against the wall. Moves it quickly over to Beagle. Lads oh my gosh, another hook. So easy to hook is. people in this game. Not a great time for that penalty to show up here. You only got a one goal lead, and you better hope as you sit there, your penalty killers do the job. The Coyotes send their men a 
advantage unit out once more. Even though this is a great chance to tie the game, you still have to remain a little bit patient. Don't panic with the puck. Houston's got it in their own zone. Takes it into the slot. Oh, they telegraphed the pass, and he picks it off. And that's off oh, stopping the We play. got bailed out. The next date for these guys when they're back on the ice. You'd be surprised at how many players don't know the schedule. They just know the really? team they're playing tonight. Oh, yeah, and they don't know who's coming next. Schmaltz has won it here at center. Hooked away at center by Kent. And that pass goes off a stick. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. Takes it from the other side of the blue line. Oh, a clutch save! Cutting to the front of the net! He scores! Go, Camp! We rip it home. This goalie is not saving much. Last season, he shot that. I think we just wish him to save Aside from the velocity of the shot, James, I think the release is so quick. The goalie's not set, and he gets beat. Just moments away from the resumption of this power play. They're ready to drop the puck here for this face-off. What's well, nice short-hand goal? Kanisov's moving the puck through his own zone. Picked up along the boards by Pacioretty. Oh. The Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Well, this power play hasn't gone according to plan. They don't have a shot on net, and now they're back in their zone, regrouping again. Right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Take it along the wall by Chernak. My what a thing. Stopped by the goal. Oh my God. Sure he had any mindset for that one, but he Failed. stopped it. The Heat had the puck in the neutral zone. Here's a short pass to Pacioretty. What a wild offensive night this has been. The Ooh. real crazy part is both teams go are the zone. It's no runaway. Somebody is going to score a couple of goals before the end of this. And that's going to be the difference. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. Whoa, Ripper. Alexander Tepsier. James, they took advantage of one little crease. And they were able to race up the He's ice. He's walking so clapping. Another short-handed goal, too. Hey, when there's this much traffic, James, the goal is just going to drive. We are not feeling the effect of the short-handed goal. Try and play the percentages and hope the puck hits him. Because he can't see it. There's so much traffic in front of the net. He doesn't find it, it doesn't hit him, and it's in the goal. Houston's won the draw in the neutral zone. Klingberg's got it in the defensive end. Still keeps the ball in the puck. White's ready to go. Get that puck. That's all. Go get that puck. The Coyotes' man advantage comes to an end and not the result they were looking for giving up a shorty well that doesn't go according to plan the power play's done and they've given up a shorty those are always deflating in close shuts it down with the paddle what a stop up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area quick feed to Klingberg and it banks off a stick in traffic the Coyotes get a hold of the puck along the boards takes the feed from the left side Shot handles that one. Houston's got a hold of the puck. And now he angles it across to Texas. Uh oh, Jackson coming off the bench. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Houston's got possession of the puck. Moves it to Beagle. And he takes the pass. And the puck leaves the zone. Quick pass to Beagle. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. The Coyotes take it along the wall. Moves it up through the middle from the right. Houston's got the puck in their own end. Quick shot. We're keeping that first one off there. We can get, we can get, uh, Chaggy for... So based on that, I'm giving him the edge in our matchup tonight. We'll try it. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. He's got one out there. Center 
Bucks are lined up and we are ready to resume. I guess how weird could you log? I have won the draw here in the offensive zone. Playing Burke's hungry for that third one. He's got two. He took that quick little pass. Now he's a dangerous okay. player. Sends it in front. Great defensive play to pick off the pass. Mm. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Centering feed. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. And the crowd's on their feet, saluting the team after a hard-fought effort this evening. And that pass doesn't go. Stoppage in play as we get an offside. I don't think I can happen anymore. Extra attacker out here with the empty net on the face off. Oh. A lot of pressure on the center, but you need to face off. Okay. We still take that W. Let's go. They didn't come. You know who loves a winner? Everybody, listen to this play. You want everybody on the same side, win some games. The players salute the fans who get to cheer a great evening. Hope you had as much fun as we did here tonight, and we will see you the next time. At least we hope so. From all of us here at EA Sports, take care. Number nine. 19. Who's number 19? I wonder. Is that like our. Yeah, is that him? Is he number 19? 26 or No, he's something four. You can't see everybody's number. We'll look, we'll look at the lobby. I don't know who number 19 is. Number 19, oh, final guess, um, Al Saifalo. If it's not him, then I accept my L. So I'm gonna guess Al Saifalo. Oh, yeah, he is. Okay, I just saw it there. Yeah, he's number 57, E2. Where the fudge is he? Why is I fall on the bench? No, we didn't do this. Oh, so he wasn't even in the game. The course of the whole game, he wasn't even in. Yep, that'll do it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. As always, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Peace.